<clears throat> Welcome back guys to the Chris Gaming TV. Today we're going to do more Kingdom Death Monster on Tabletop Simulator. Um, last time the Butcher absolutely annihilated us so I think we're going to go with the Antelope this time. The Screaming Antelope. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, please leave a like, subscribe and comment. If you do subscribe, uh, click the bell to be notified. If you're watching this on Twitch, don't forget to subscribe. Um, subscribe and um, follow. Uh, see how this goes. <clears throat> so, shall we go then? Uh, yeah, is everyone... Uh, qu what did we unlock from the Butcher? No, uh, nothing. nothing. Did not unlock something. No, no. Mm, the map. He has the direction. I mean, if we unlocked anything, I think that would have been if we killed him. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh well, all right, okay. I wasn't too sure if it unlocked but a no, new it settlement it base or something. doesn't unlock anything. Just trying to look. What are the bandages? Hide. All oh, right, okay. <clears throat> Oh well, guess we'll depart for the Screaming Antelope or whatever then, if that's what you just want to try. They'll unlock new gear and things. It's up to you guys. Yeah, uh, well, might as well. Do we add the, the Butcher to the qu the quarries? No. No? Can't hunt Nemesis monsters. No, it's just because it has Nemesis encounters at all, and I thought maybe it's, it's just something you add to the list. Like the Nemesis no. monsters at the bottom. You can see there's Nemesis monsters available to encounter. Yeah, Nemesis monsters <coughs> cannot be hunted. No, but there's an actual part just for Nemesis monsters. Yes. I mean, sure, if you want to... Add something to that be my guess, but yeah, I just thought that's what it was. Was is there anything we need to read or do for the screaming antelope, or does it just go straight to the? Well, I think hunt? we need to go to the hunt. I think we need to hunt it first, anyway. Yeah, I mean, if you're gonna read anything, it's gonna be during the showdown. Yeah, about so everyone's ready. Yep. I'm not touching anything, I'll let you move wherever you, you know what you're doing, Skarmory. Omega, give your self survivals. Yeah, you get plus one survival from the settlement as well now. I can't believe we lost our wait, like, wait, weapon got the efficiency. Supplement? You mean limit? No? No. Oh, well, well I, I, I have like eight, so I'm always at max. Ah, I was going to say, most of my gear gave me mine back anyway. Good for you guys. <clears throat> yeah, exactly my thought. So level one, I guess. Oh yeah. <laughs> level yeah. zero, new guy. Ah, uh, it's it started level one. And yeah, let's see. Why are you? Oh, you're rolling to see who's going Five. first. Oh well. <laughs> I guess Terminus. Stone. <clears throat> the stone face ground is littered with leaving center and ravenous passing beasts. Half eaten countless plants are strewn everywhere. If any survivor has three plus understanding, the survivor may skip the next hunt to space. Uh, Which don't we don't. So, random hunt event. Oh, why does the antelope always, or the enemy always start on this space? The dawn no, later it's on. A bit, it depends on if it's uh, depending on what level. And also, the lion was on this one. Yeah. Oh, so it's that big. <clears throat> 25. Okay. They're always, um, yeah, they're always different, and they can move up and down the board as well, so. Titans in the dark. And here, <coughs> centering below, marks the passing of a truly titan, I, titanic Titanic beast. Yeah. All survivors after one brain event damage. The survivors cower on the ground, lying flat as possible, and hoping they're simply too small to be worth eating. 
every survivor must roll d10, the lowest scoring survivor or survivors in the case it ties becomes a straggler. If any survivor has <coughs> the noisy gear, it minus two one roll result, each straggler rolls on the table below. Okay, so everyone take your <coughs> event brain damage. Problem is, none of we're all gonna take light damage, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, and I roll a two. Wait, do we all take light damage? <clears throat> yeah. I rolled five. <clears throat> Free. Oh wait. Uh... Yeah. Well, I'm waiting. Omega needs to roll and see if he's roll us a one or two. A nine. Six. Ah, uh, well, I'm the straggler. <clears throat> okay. So. Uh... Yeah. Straggler's got a roll again, doesn't he? Oh. Four. You make yourself extra flat against the ground and no. avoid any terrible. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh. So, okay. Oh, uh, good. I actually thought that was a one there. I was like, no way. You plucked from the ground and <laughs> eaten whole dead. I was like, oh, there's no way. <clears throat> no, 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 you move the, moving. the vent. It's clockwise. Could just flip it. Yeah, I was gonna say it's yeah, just that's what we're gonna do. Yeah. It's just an event. I just yeah. ran the event. Fifty-six. Uh, dead monster. The survivors find a rotting monster corpse of the same kind they are hunting. Well, the corpse is too rotten to be of any use. If any survivor has three plus understanding, the survivors can cover themselves. The dead monster spilled the blood. Okay. Uh, stench will help keep the survivors nick up. Um, if no survivor has three plus understanding, the starving survivor feasts upon the rot rotting corpse. All survivor lose control of their twisting guts. Each survivor gains minus one strength token, and no one can consume any items during next showdown. I have one here, Skarmory. So what have we got? <coughs> well, minus strength. Yes, everyone gets a minus strength token. Oh, thank you. Why the fuck would we eat a rotten corpse? <laughs> We're hungry. We're hungry. Oh, god. Chris, right, okay. no one has any understanding. Everyone who did died. Yeah. Everyone did die. <clears throat> yeah. The me? ground is covered with a carpet of huge rotting ticks. Each of us must try and fend off the swarm. Roll d10 and add your hunt experience to the result. On result 6 plus, you successfully smash the ticks away in shower of core. Otherwise, on a result below 6, the ticks make us you sick. Reduce the survival to 0. Roll a d10. Oh, God. Well, 2. <clears throat> okay. Uh, you just see another one. Yeah. It's a fan of you lose a strength now, isn't it? If you get the eight plus. Which I probably will now. No, no five. Just lose so all just, the survival. Uh, Don't have any, do we? Well, I'm going to do it. Yeah. I rolled five. Yep, same so for I'll you. So roll again. Yeah. Six yeah. plus. Lose all survival just. My turn? Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Two. Yeah. Roll again. Lose all survival and roll again. Ooh. One. One. You're okay. So yeah. only I lose all survival. And Skarmory then. Let's see if someone actually gets to keep their survival. No. Nope. <coughs> oh. <laughs> the good thing is Omega gives us plus one strength anyway, so. Well, I am just kind of. Survival. 
No, the if you want. fist. Yeah, you can spend your strength to get a survival if you want. No, but we all will get the strength <coughs> token. Also yeah, well, because you red fist. We'll take us all back to normal. So it's not like we're losing that much. Um, and then we're fighting. Yeah. Oops, now this one uh, we forgot. Does it actually matter that much? So just remove all your tokens because you get your plus one back. And the nightmare tree, I'm sure, gives really good resources as well. Uh, don't remove them, you should have minus one and plus one in case you want to spend it. For no, well, minus one plus one equals normal. Just yes, but you can it. still you can your ability lets you spend the plus one to get survival. Well, I suppose, but that that's weird. Not really. So we'll just remove the strength and then we'll just be back to normal. No, because you have a minus strength token and a plus strength token. Yeah. It's not the stats, it's just tokens. Uh, see. Plus, they might do something where you have to remove the strength stuff as well, so it's best just to keep both of them on. <coughs> okay. How trampled? Let's see. Seems like it doesn't have that tick ability. Terminus, you know where you get fleas. Or is that trample? Seven and three. They must be playing it on a different level or something. Unless it's a mood or trait card. Whoa, there's lots of <coughs> stuff in like this place. Yeah, and I'm sure the tree gives good stuff I was reading a while back. Um, Nightmare tree, okay. Yeah, the lonely ants you can get. Oh, you can get a broken lantern. Um, It needs to be six spaces away each plant. Uh, we, each can, I, um, uh, we can ignore that because the sh uh, showdown setups tells us to just put it four spaces <coughs> from the monster. Oh, okay. So it overrules that then. Yeah. Ooh, and survives are gotta be on the very edge, don't they? Yeah, the other two, however, do apply. So we have to put the tree and the debris. Five spaces away from all board edges. I don't have that no more. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, this will be uh, maybe here. Then. We, we can move some of the plants if you want. Yeah, it needs to be like five spaces away from all board edges. Yeah. That's better.
What do you think? Better if we are all on the same side or some on different sides? You've got to be on the... Ah, right. Um, well, if he's wanting the plants, it might be worth everyone being this side, unless... <clears throat> the tree... The thing is, these plants... I guess I can be bait. These plants, you've got to be careful. I'm sure the antelope eats them and gets life back. Yes, it does. So it's best to try and pick these up as well. Um, I'm not sure what it does with the nightmare tree. It does something, though. don't know if that buffs it or something. It does something to us. No, it just blocks us. But I'm sure these also give us survival back if we eat these plants. If we consume them. Yeah, plus one survival, so... It's another way for us to get survival back if we do get... Where, where's the debris? Oh, this there. This here. I'm, I'll just pick it up straight away. I don't have no ranged abilities or whatever. What's something about adjacent to an edge? I mean, on the edge? Well, I'm not sure how to interpret that if they mean like on the adjacent, adjacent, means adjacent next to, to the edge. Means yeah. next to the edge. Yeah, so which do you consider the edge? The last square or the actual like border? There? I'd say that is adjacent to the edge, but. Well, I'd say the last. The square is the whole edge? Because it goes up adjacent then. Is that the edge adjacent to next to the Ah, right, ah, uh, yeah, fair enough. Actually, I think Omega is right, however. You put it like that. It tells us to put us <coughs> to start on the edge, apparently. Best we'll grab all the resources we can now because we've lost loads of it. Yeah. You placed your pillar, Omega? Uh, no, no, you don't have that anymore. Have no more. Yeah. That's too close. So this one is no, that, that, no, they can be anywhere in this encounter. So it says it has to be six pieces away from each other. Yeah, but the board, uh, the rule book says they have to be in a certain area next to the monster. Yeah, because if you basically if you fight the monster in this circle area where we're at now, like all of these, it'll like. It'll eat and keep. It's it's harder to fight it in this one area. If that makes sense, because it's gonna heal up and things. Only if he has to do his, and uh, if he has no targets. Yeah, <clears throat> which I think he's got a six range, is he, or five or something? Let's have six. a look. Uh, so he's probably gonna start eating these right at the beginning, which. I don't know what else buffs it gets Doesn't for doing it. Matter that much. <clears throat> um. So. Yeah, Skarmer, do you want to start it as the monster controller? Sure. Uh, closest survivor in field of view. No one. Well, no. that this is the thing we screwed up yesterday, Chris. Basically, if it just says closest survivor in field of view, he will actually target and go towards someone if there is someone in the field of view. Oh, so it doesn't matter if it's how far away it is. No, I mean, if he can't reach anyone, he just goes towards them and then stops and does no attack. Oh, instead of just shouting, doing the menace. Yeah, but yeah. that means that you will never shout and do the menace because there will always be someone in field of view. No, if if we had two two people alive and they were standing right behind him, for example. Uh, if, or if everyone was behind the tree. Yeah. But no one is in field of view. Or... Well, uh, yes, you are. I am, and Chris I, is. Only one Omega is. Oh, I, I really, I really need a cheat sheet of that one. I, <laughs> I really can't remember the difference between them. I'm How do you tell tree. which way it's facing? That, that that's field of view, and oh, then yeah, the whole board isn't it? Line of sight from the tree will block Omega from it. Uh. 
So it's us three basically, so <clears throat> So yeah, you, you gotta pick choose. Skarmory. I think it's better he goes off to me. Yeah, because you get the insanity as well from that. Yeah. But he won't get enough. Yeah. So he yeah, stops. But he's Why did you start over there? He's Do I still you want to bait it away? Then? Yeah, you targeted yourself. Okay. <coughs> he's uh he's baiting it away from us, sort of thing. Oh, why? So you can gather plants. Yeah, but you're going to die. Yeah, well, better die. that uh, I die than the rest of you. No, I, I think we should have learned that from the butcher that having someone die is not a good thing, no matter what. Thank you. Do you want me just to get rid of this debris then? Yeah, you can. Can I do the debris then move? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Because uh, we might as well try and get all these plants up, so I'll just roll whatever, d10. Yeah. Get out of the way with. A six. Six. Uh, gain one random basic resource. Gain. So we might as well get a hide. Nice. So that's good. Nice. Right, yeah. I'll, I'll go to the tree <coughs> now. Hopefully we can build you some... Uh, um, I'll move... One, two, three, four, five. Hopefully we can get you some gear, Skarmory, and same for you, Terminus, if you need more. Well, like, I have actually too many you're weapons good. and too little armor. Yeah, Maybe Skarmory I needs aim at the armor. Screaming. One of us should aim at the white lion yeah. here. Stack plus, stack plus, stack plus. Four. Ah, four. Fuck, I'm not down. What? No. Oh, yes, you are, actually. Sorry. Tangled in the grass, you're knocked down. You don't... Yeah. Do we get rid of this tree, though? No, no. it doesn't say anything about archiving it. No. <coughs> okay. You can, you can keep rolling out until you get the lantern. That's what my plan to do. Uh, no, you don't. You don't uh, archive it even then, it seems. Yeah, yeah I think it just stays here. I was going to say, there's no archive for anything. I mean, the lone the answers are good because it's a vermin I'm resource. I'm going to pick but... the uh, Acanthus plant. Okay. And fail horribly. What'd you roll? Five. Uh, uh, you find you something tasty. One survival. Yeah. So you get your survival back. That's Ooh, good. Nice, that's good. <clears throat> Honestly, yeah. better. Uh, I wanted the plant, but whatever. Um, it's your move, Skarmory. I think you're the only one who doesn't yeah, have one of them dry plants, so... Move as far away as possible. <laughs> no, no, up the way, up the way, you can go farther up the way. Are you, are you, why are you moving towards him? What are you doing? Maybe well, I could go it. down also. Ah, uh, yeah, no, but, but up will be farther away. Yeah, exactly, you'll get farther from him if ah. you go up. One, two, three, four, five, so he can get you there. Well, I only have five movement spaces. Yeah, but you want up one? No, I think you meant you could have gone. Just directly straight off. off. Just straight off. You'll be six away, you can't get you there. Well, I'm sorry, ah, then. There you go. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. No, no, I was right, he's right, he's right, he's right. Yeah, uh, stop. Why one, don't two, you full three, move? Four, five. Oh no, he can. Oh, he's right. Yeah, one more. Ah, yeah, he can't take you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> God, the yellow power range. I wasn't terrible. allowed to do my first move, so. <laughs> <coughs> um. That's everyone's turn. You don't yeah. have any ranged weapons. Oh, right. You have a ranged weapon, but you can't use it now. So yeah. you're right. Yeah. <coughs> Ghost Knockdown Survivor. Oh, well, he's gonna run off over to us anyway. I can't get me, I'm behind the tree. Well, I would just run towards us. closest no. threat in. Oh shit, we don't have any threats in range. There's no closest knockdown survivor, and there's no furthest threat. So he does graze them. Yeah, he's gonna graze. 
Once Phil moves to the closest plant, ends its turn. So it's just going to archive one of these plants. Yeah, yeah the bottom one. <coughs> That's not that bad, though, when you think about it, because uh, it, it, it haven't wounded it, so it's not like we're losing anything. Yeah. Where does it tell you what, gra what graze does? Uh, on the basic, the Santalo, on the card, it's at the bottom. Instinct. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, Omega gets back up now. You run away again. Ah, uh, good, uh, good. Make way around to us. Nice. Um, do you want me to try and get one of these plants again? Uh, yeah, go for it. Try and get you some heal, like a healing thing, hopefully. Should I do another roll on the tree? Seven. Oh, nice. No, that's a one want. survivor. Oh, no, wait, that's a seven. It's a Find certain consume one survival. Oh well. Yeah. Try my best to get you one of these plants. <laughs> uh, I've lost mine. Hey, you're getting survival. That's good. Oh, did you yeah. use yours? Like, Do you I used roll it in the, the butcher tree, then. Oh. Oh my god. Do you, you want me to roll on the tree again? No, I'm asking if you want to roll on the tree. Sure. <clears throat> Ah, fuck one, I got ants. Ah, we still got a, a thing though. Lonely ant, vermin resource. I'll find it. But you do what? You suffer one uh, arm one damage. damage. Alright, so I'm not doing the tree again. But you got a resource though. Archive this to swap oh, your insanity. And survive oh, the fires. Swap my insanity in survival? Wow, okay. But you have none of them. Yeah. Yeah, I'm uh, gonna roll on the tree as well. I have none of each. Yeah. I'll get over six. Ah, god, you're knocked down. Um. Has everyone took the turn then? Yeah. Yeah. That's so, three rolls, not so one yeah, over it's six. Ome Omega's turn to be monster controller. Oh, surviving field of view. That'd be me. <clears throat> yep. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, target okay, gains maybe. one bleed. Yeah, it's enough to hit me. Yeah, just move him all the way up. He's gonna get there. Oh, it's a perfect distance, is it? No, he's, he could go one further, I think. Yeah. So he's got to roll one dice plus two to get. Have you got any sort of toughness or anything? No. I'm a new guy, what do you expect? Three. Three. Oh, yeah, it's a hit. So, two damage. One hit location, two damage. Yeah, and to the hands. And a bleed. Turn over them. Yeah. You get back up. Skarmory won't get back up though, will he? No. No, he won't. Do you want us to encourage your Skarmory or? Wait, he's knocked down as well? Yeah, yeah it's like a heavy hit to the hands. Do you want us oh, to encourage shit. your Skarmory so you can get out the way or? Problem is, we don't really have the survival to do that. I, I do. Why do you have one? I've got one, but I can still encourage him to get out of the way, maybe. Yeah, uh, well, you can, but the odds are it's going to chase after him. <coughs> oh, probably better he's not the threat, isn't he? 
Yeah, move I mean, towards, he's not a uh, threat now, so hopefully it will go after someone else. Right, I'll move and get this plant then. I try and get this yeah. plant for whoever wants the thing. I kind of want one of us to get a lantern look out of this tree before we start packing it. One. one. That's bad, isn't it? One arm damage. <sighs> God damn, shitty rolls. Yeah, I'm <coughs> gonna go up and go after the other plant. You remove your armor or... Yeah, move my armor. Fuck, I have to roll in the tree again. Six. That's one survival, isn't it? No, that's broken lantern. Basic resource. No, I, I, I'm not on the tree. No, no, no. Oh, sorry. <coughs> uh, you consume it and get one lantern. How did, how did you delete this before, Skarmory? Backspace. Oh, so you can actually delete them? Oh, you yeah, but them. I think only the host can, so... Alright, oh, no yeah. problem. Yeah, we can't delete them. So it's better I do it also, just right. in case. I'll roll on the tree then, uh -huh. it. We're gonna damage ourselves just off this tree alone, I can see it now. <laughs> I can see him losing an arm. Five. Fuck sick. <clears throat> Knock down. Knock down. It's not worth Thanks, it, man. Thanks, guys, for the help. You know, you know, oh, broken oh, lantern oh, oh, is just junk. Um, actually, Skarmory, I'm gonna encourage you now. Okay. You can get up and move. Yeah, you get up. You probably you could get around behind them. Might be better, maybe. Yeah, might be. Then again, he might kick you if you're behind them, but. But. You can attack, can't you? It's a gamble. As none of us have been trampled on yet, have we? No. no. I'll go for an attack. Oh, here we go. Um, Is it just... Two dice. Well, that's mm. one hit. Yeah. Oh, two. And. Yo, what was him roll like land like criticals on yeah. <clears throat> on uh, the actual accuracy thing of it? Uh, I'll do the uh, uh, this one first. <coughs> yeah. Wait, uh, if you hit with a club or shield, I don't. Yeah, you need to roll a five to damage. God, oh, club or shield? That's awesome. That you clobber it. Wait. All oh, right, the uh, the strength token is neutralized. That yeah. What did you roll? Eight. Eight. Cool. Oh, nice. I do the other one down. It's got ten life. Okay. <clears throat> Four. Yeah, that's not uh, enough. One at a time, target the survivor in the zone of death and perform basic action. Okay. Yeah, so Omega, you're gonna attack Skarmory then. Two dice? Yeah. Yeah. Does he only need two plus to, to wound? Yeah. Yeah, I'm probably gonna die today again. Yep. Wouldn't I'm really shit at this game. <laughs> well, you are the one who wanted to go Five over there. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, um, yeah, so. Skarmory two hit locations. How much damage? One each. One, one each. So one boot. And one, one. body. God damn! I'm have to try and get you some gear. <laughs> yeah, everyone just yep. focused on their own, so I was fucked. <clears throat> Uh, I'll just move them. No, we've done our attack. I'm confused. Yeah, that's it's monsters the... organized. Is it the yeah, monsters' turn now? Yes. Right. Furthest threat in range. Yep, that's me. Um, <clears throat> so, 
that's uh, moving at attack, so. Yeah. And it's going to be one speed, two plus to attack, one damage, and then after. Right, so it's hit. Cool. So you get one damage to a location, uh, add one damage yeah, to Yeah, I'm attack. dodging. Yeah, because that one would hit uh, really hard. Oh yep. god, yes. Have you got a survive? Have you even got a survive two dodge? Yeah, he had got oh, all right, yeah. Yeah, I got two thanks to the Acanthus plant. <coughs> <coughs> well, that's it, the monster turnover. I'll yeah, go for the Omega plant. gets back up now. I was going to say, you're going for the plant, so I'll. I'll move there. I'm going to start doing some damage, I think. Uh, ten. ten. Nice. I got the plant. It's the best result. <laughs> nice, good, you can heal yourself. Not like it's taken much damage, though. Oh, yeah, I guess it? everyone has moved except me. Ah. It's a strange resource. You, you could get behind it, Thomas. I don't want to get behind it. Oh, fully heals one hit location, including injury levels and armor point armor points. Um, I'm gonna attack one. <clears throat> it's one, one. seven. Really likes clubs and shields, doesn't it? Yeah, well, I'm guessing. Yes, like it. yes, yeah, it's a hit. It's a hit. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I think that's that. Monster. Everyone's turn. So, it's you, Skarmory. Full move in the direction of the mon monsters facing and turn to the closest facing. Oh, we are so lucky. There's no one under. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, it would have done a uh, trample as well. Yep. Oh, we're yep. so lucky. Uh, random survivor in range. That'll be amazing. Well, you, should, you should face someone first. <coughs> or well, you should face Chris first, I guess, because he's the closest one. Well, and uh, can he move? Uh, no. Or... Yeah, he can. He can move again. Yeah, because I think it's move and attack. Yeah, but yeah, it's supposed to be a random survivor. Sorry. <coughs> in range, so I guess that's oh. Chris, me, and you. I don't know, I think. Oh, it's Omega in range? Yeah, he is, actually. Yeah, so it's basically all of yeah, us. Yeah, everyone. Terminus. And what do you know? It's me. Who's <laughs> back to where he was? <laughs> oh, you could have moved us here. And yeah, then you might be able to get behind. Yeah. I uh, mean, it's up to you <coughs> which one you want to move. I think both were the same amount of spaces. Mm. Well, uh, it's good for anyone, that other. Hit. To the light feet. Oh, did you, have you seen that? Ruined horns, the pitiful attack fails. A random side yeah, yeah. one. It's a persistent injury if he has that. <clears throat> That's pretty cool. It's the only attack I've seen where it can actually hurt itself, really. 
spot, it doesn't hurt itself. No, it, it, it gets, just uh, gives on a random survivor one survival. I mean, I'm saying though, it yeah. ruins its own horns though. That's no, weird. it if someone has killed its horns. Oh, it's if it's you've ruined it. Oh. oh, okay. Yeah, I thought it meant that, like if it failed to like sort of ram you or whatever. No, it's no. Um. Yep. Yeah. Um. So yes. Terminus, do you want to be lockdown. encouraged? Um, well, it's all being range. Might get some attacks in on this. That's that's all I'm thinking. Do you want us to encourage um, you? It's, it's it's up to you. <coughs> they only have one survival left. Uh, I'll encourage you. I rather we've got some Thank damage you. on us. Yeah, let me move them first and yeah. attack. Could you move behind them? You could have uh, went behind. The rest of you can move behind them if you want to. I was I thinking I could use behind. my bow and arrow. Well, I don't care. I don't want to stand behind them. You can. You I'm also afraid. use your spear if you moved there as well. So oh, one, one, one hit. hit. <clears throat> Oh, rip, Chris. Well, no, it won't be, be down. Maybe down also. Yeah. Because you're at an awkward. So or would it you didn't yeah, hit I us. Guess. So. <clears throat> would it go down like this? Did you hit it? No, I did no, not. It, hit wouldn't it. it go to down? No, it would just go down the board. Yes. Well, it says away from. Yes, but I mean, the movement That's is down. either to the left or down. So it'll be down? Like... Well, it's up to the monster controller. Wait, it makes, <laughs> it makes perfect sense. Well, it depends. It would make sense for it to trample you. Yeah. Wouldn't it be on this no. space? No. No. Because it was attacking you? No, it wasn't attacking me. I was attacking oh, you. Oh, you attack. All right, yeah. Okay. Um, I failed to attack, so oh, the antelope failure. ran away. Oh, god damn. Right, I'm gonna... Do you want to go behind or do you want me, Skarnry? I'm thinking of using bow and arrow. Oh, yeah, I'll go behind. One, two, three. Oh, I can't do that. So, I think it's two and dice. And it's... Yeah. How many Five wounds? To hit. Five to hit. Right. And um, five to wound, I think. Oh, because I've got accuracy, haven't I? I think. No, you don't. I think that guy died. Oh, yeah. oh shit. Yeah, you miss anyway, so... <clears throat> oh, actually, you need six to wound. But yeah, it doesn't matter. <coughs> yeah, I'll use my bow and arrow. Don't forget you got the raw hide um, to um, Mega. Yeah. I've got the what? You've got the hide helmet to check the cards. Oh shit, yeah. Because uh, uh, you're not going to be able to make it into range. Yeah, it's oh, up to you want to move or not. No, wait, oh, I can't. Right, yeah, no, you can't. You are right. So, Mega, what you're going to... Round on two seconds. Could you not move and then spear him? Who? Skarmory. No, because it doesn't. He's used all his actions. Oh, right. My bow and arrow cost a movement down an action. Oh, you've got, oh, used, right, okay. I keep forgetting that, but he does. Oh, no. I thought, I keep thinking it's a bit like the harp, if you know what I mean. Um. I mean, you could use your raw hide and see what's coming out. Mega went BRB. Oh. Well, I mean, he's here. He's just trying to figure out what to do. <laughs> I assume. Ah. Oh.
Okay, he's using the headband, I guess. Oh my. Hmm. So, chow down basically just perform it's just a basic action. No. Yeah. Yeah. So it would be better to have that one top, and then have everyone run out of range. But Chris is not going to make it away. <coughs> no, I'm screwed. This is even I mean screwed on great kick as well. Random survivor in blind spot. <laughs> I'm like the only one yeah. in the blind spot. Yeah, I yeah, definitely. No, I mean, for for the greater kick, <clears throat> we can run away the next turn, but you can't. You can't make it out of range in time. Well, yeah, go ahead and put them back then. Yeah, I was gonna say that one. So yeah, I'm gonna go with the monster then. So basic action. Oh, wait there. So if it's a bit action, it just does graze, doesn't it? Yep. And I can't graze, so... It does nothing. What do I do then? Nothing. If there's no, no. on the show button, instead of full move forward in a straight line, so it just... Oh, make it out ranging for kick. Yep. <clears throat> Did then? <laughs> yep. Alright, so how far do I need... So if I was to go, say, for this tree... Um, you need to be six away from it. Six bases. Yeah. So... You need, you need to be one further away. I'll just go there, just... Just be the safe side. Are you any mm. in range for ranged weapons or? No. No. Oh, I think we're cocked up as well. Doesn't every survivor now settlement also new survivor get a founding stone? No. No. They do get an understanding, but. Oh, I didn't put my understanding well, I on. I they get an understanding. I didn't put my understanding on. Yeah, you get one from Graves. Alright, so we should all have an understanding. Yeah. So, does anyone else actually want to move this turn, or...? Wouldn't it be better to have him run to us? Yeah, I think so. <clears throat> yeah, I think as well. Do you think Omega it, can up. Omega could have used this thing again as AI cards? The headband again? Yeah, just still you... can if you want <clears throat> to. Well, you'd have to collect from the tree. Yeah. 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 Yeah, okay. Roll yep. for the tree then. Honestly, you've broken lanterns. Like, it's junk, isn't it? I think it's something you can smelt later on or something. Yeah. Is it not worth Well, it's, it's supposed to be really good, it's just that we can't use it yet. Yeah, it'll be That's further really down the line. It's something you melt, I think you melt them down for like better weapons, so. Yeah. <clears throat> it's not worth losing your arm over. Oh, yeah. another great kick when this. Oh, that's the bugs, isn't it? That's his trait. Yeah. Actually, he's not going to come running for us. He's going to graze, though, isn't he? Yeah. But he's just going to go back into this wall? Yep. No, actually... So if he's full moving, he should be able to be moved to the one of the sides since he's already at the wall, I think. Or is that just for knockbacks? I think 
knocked back. I don't know. It's just full, full moving forward, which is forward, I guess. So yeah, it's best to keep the kick, I guess. The t the ticks is bad as well. Yeah, the ticks is pretty bad. And it will be for the rest of the game. What will it? It's a trade. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you mean for the rest of the showdown? Yeah, sorry. Yeah, and he's gonna draw the great kick anyway. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, I would put this one first, Omega. Then this one. Because we don't want the bugs. And Omega's monster control anyway, so... More or less just moving the AI over to the discard, because I can't do anything. Well, now it's the end of the monster turn, right? Or yeah, but he needs to drawn move a this. card yet. Ah. Me? Yes. End the monster turn, then. <clears throat> yeah. Furthest threat in field of view in range. Yeah, there's no one. So, Graze just makes it run forward. Yeah. Which is basically the wall. Yeah, so it doesn't yeah. do anything. Problem now is, we know the Tix is coming up, so is it worth us getting closer or not? Well, it will be permanent, so... When the thing is... Unless we move closer to it, it's just gonna lay <coughs> down gonna keep, there. Yeah. I'm moving. I've moved, so. We need to start killing it. Um, I think I'm actually in range. Oh, nice. So basically, if you can wound this, we yeah, can get rid I'm of that trait. Attacking with bone darts, I'm probably gonna miss. If you do, though, that that'll be great. <laughs> if you hit, ah. miss, but I don't. Yeah, Omega, it's your turn if you want to move. No, but can I take the roll the tree? Yeah, sure. Five. Sec. You have really been a great help there in this <coughs> fight, Omega. You know that. <laughs> Alright, so I'm monster control then? Yeah. Oh fuck, he will go and trace. Uh how have I done? So how's this work? So when this comes into play the monster gains one toughness, which the uh Skarmory's added. Discovering the ticks is gruesome. Roll 1d10 for each survivor on a result of 6 plus. Suffer 1 brain damage per oh monster. Oh god. So do I roll yeah, for um, all you no, guys? Um, or you um, roll? Well, actually you should probably roll. Okay. I use the red dice because it looks scarier. Yeah, who are you rolling for? I'm rolling for... I'll just go down the list. Terminus first. Okay. Yes. Right. So... Funny. You don't get a brain damage. No Skarmory. Yeah. Thank Sick. God I have insanity. Yeah. <clears throat> um, this is for Herself. me. Oh, That's so a that's... severe brain injury. Oh shit. Time to roll the wheel of death. Oh. So it's 1d10 yeah. isn't it? Yeah. I knew I should have kept that survival. <laughs> What'd you get? Three. Oh, three, he made it. Memory loss. You can use your drive two levels shit. of weapon proficiency. That's alright. 
Yeah, that's not too bad. You shouldn't oh. have any weapon proficiency oh, anyway. Of course. Yeah, I could use the dried thing, couldn't I? Why would you waste that now? No, I mean later later on. If, why? Anyway, yeah. rolling for Omega. Does that just get discarded then? Like, I lose what? it. That that's oil thing. Yeah, if you use it, you'd get discarded. Yeah, Omega, it, five. Omega makes it out alive. So, so Omega got five. So, right, so that's that part of it done. Um, yeah. Draw an AI them. card. Oh, you've already put them there. Did you shuffle them as well? Yeah. Alright. Okay, good. It's uh, Bolt. Closest to, uh, closest knockdown survivor. No, mm -hmm. uh, oh, yes. So, can... Yeah, he's gonna, just going to move towards him. Oh, how am I doing that one then? So, do I move all the way to him or just... It's no, he can only move six One, spaces. Two, three, four, five, six. Is that right? Yeah. Um. <coughs> so it doesn't do anything else now, does it? Uh, well, should still full move the screaming antelope in a straight line away from all survivors. So that would be down or up, that way. Yeah, I'd say that is the best away from everyone. I'm not sure you could go that far, but I didn't actually count. Yeah, I think that's the yeah. right one. <coughs> that's yeah, that's monster. that one. Your back up, Omega. Yeah, I'm just gonna move towards it. We're like little slugs, aren't we? Going down a racetrack. Yeah. What do you want to do, Omega? Do you want to use your raw hide or do you want to try the tree again? Are you using your headband? Do any action? Omega. What? Are you are you doing action or? Oh, yeah. Okay. <coughs> Chair down is just a basic action. Getting chowed up is probably better because then we have a chance of getting rid of greater kick. Yeah, so I'll put greater kick back then, chow down. That's that then, isn't it? Okay, so it just goes. Yeah. Uh, oh, shit, I'm not, not going to be able to. Assist. Play Shao down on the top of the monster AI deck instead of discarding it. Yes, but since you ah, right, did not yeah. have any plants, you discarded yeah. it instead. Yeah. Oh god. This is kinda bad. <clears throat> I 
fair if I can. No. It's gonna kick one of us, isn't it? Yep. Probably me. Uh, probably not, actually. Oh, seeing that Omeg could use his headband and, make, and put the kick to the bottom. Yeah, but that only works if there's something <coughs> better on top now. Well, I mean, he can still see. Oh god, we've only done two damage to <coughs> it. I know. It moves around too much. Well, the Mega, are you going to do anything? Can you use your headband or? Oh. Is it me or is his mic not working? I think he's just not talking. Uh, close to survive in field of view. <clears throat> I couldn't even tell you which one's worse or not. Great kick, it's got a lot. Oh, great kick's terrible though, isn't it? Look at the speed on it. Yeah. Are well, you thinking maybe bite? I'm and then try and bite. wound him? Try and wound him I'm to get rid of the kick. Yeah, so you think put bite yeah. back? Uh, think great oh. kick back and then bite. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. <coughs> oh, no, 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 no. Hi, that one. <laughs> yeah. Then that, that one. one. So here we go, and this is me, isn't it? Yep. God, one dice, two damage. Yeah, nine. So yeah, I hit. Well, down to low pit. Two to the hand. And Chris is knocked down. Yep. <coughs> yep, that's the monster turn. Please wound us to get rid of this stupid kick. <laughs> yeah. Um, do you want to go first, Omega, or should I? How do you want me to attack? Well, yeah, the closest. You how you want it. And you can get behind us. Which means that if you don't get rid of the kick, you're gonna take it. <laughs> and have you been rolling for your survival back, Omega? Oh no, you can't because you gotta spend it to get it back, don't you? Yeah, you gotta spend it to get <coughs> it back. Please wound this. Because <laughs> if not, yeah. I, I'm probably gonna die. <laughs> yeah, two, two oh, dies, nice. five plus to hit. Yeah, where is it? Here. It was down here, Terminus. <coughs> Oof, one, hit. one hit. Please, please hit this. <laughs> Oop. First strike. Uh, attacker suffers one brain damage. Yeah, that's severe brain trauma. Roll a d10. <clears throat> wow, so he doesn't even get their attack. It's just instantly like stares him down. That's pretty shit. Yeah, I'm shit. pretty sure that's the way it works. I must check to make sure, but... You must select this first. Are you sure it's not when you put two cards down? You've got to you've got to do this one first. 
Yes, that's what it means. But let's say, um, yeah, it doesn't say if you're supposed to do that before or after the hit. Doesn't it say you must select this first? Yes, but that's just if he draws multiple cards. I think he's got to like attack that one first. But then again, it's not like <clears throat> it's not letting them like attack though, because it says cancel all hits and and then the attack. If you're insane. I suppose because I'm with the human like fear if the attack is. Oh, so he just suffers one brain damage because he's not insane, isn't he? But he's no, already not insane. He's already got a light damage, so then he's got to roll on the the chart. Can you not yeah. use his dried acanthus? He could. Because I don't you, know if it's used or not. It might. I know if you roll one, it might take your head off. <laughs> or yeah, something. Basically, if you roll <coughs> one or two, you're dead. Do you want to take that risk? Oh you might... no! Ah, hang on, hang on, just. Uh, we can't die on brain rules. <coughs> what? What? Adapt darkness. We can't die on brain rules. Oh right. Yeah, so we just do the rule. Yeah, so we screwed up on Chris's roll as well then. Well, I didn't do anything to us anyway, so. All oh, right, two plus to brain trauma rolls. <clears throat> yeah. Um. Well, Chris, it would have been worse if we had done that one correctly to you, but oh well. Oh well, no, no. Too late now. Oh, because we embrace. Oh, yeah, 10. oh. 13. You mean 12. Uh, 12. You're knocked down. Add your current survival to insanity and reduce survival to zero. Gain a random disorder. Yeah, if you all so... are a free disorder, you die. Go pull a oh, random so disorder. A disorder shit. <coughs> you, you can cue oh, this. 12 fucking bad, that sucks. Yeah. Oh no, I thought that would have been like a good way. It's not a good thing because you're getting brain trouble. shuffle? You just pick one? I shuffled. Pick yeah, one. Pick one. You don't have to flip that Skarmory. Binge eating disorder. <laughs> yeah, that sounds familiar. Int is the only thing that helps you escape as long you cannot depart unless you have couldn't. Well, you do have consumable gear, so this isn't going to affect you till next departure. <clears throat> I don't believe you got the binge eating disorder. Because <laughs> some goat was staring at you. <laughs> <laughs> well, now you got to roll to see if you... No, he's knocked down. Oh, is he? Alright, okay. Yeah. So that's. So yeah, that's the end of this <coughs> turn, sadly. No, did this take effect right now? Um. Yes, but you don't have to consume your bug if that's you're, what you're asking. You're not departing. It says you cannot depart. No, it, it says you must consume if a choice to consume arises, but that ah, but doesn't I, count. I, this character can't go out on a hunt if they don't have a consumable. Yeah. Yeah. So you can keep the bug. But if, uh, but hang on, when will this ever come into play? There's no reason to ever use this. It's like it's when you're departing. No, yeah, no, no, you can keep it forever, and then uh, yes, you can still depart. But you might get other events where you have a choice to I, consume or not. You must this, consume. This consume me herb. If I ever get a death roll, I have to use it. Yeah. So. Okay. That's fine. <clears throat> yeah, and there's a lot of like events where it says you find. Some rotten food on the floor. Do you want to eat it or not? And you have to roll a dice. You just consume no, it straight I have away. Ah, yeah. oh, basically. Yeah. Um, right, yeah, cool. um, it's actually on Eric Cartman as well. Like of all people, like the carrot is actually fat. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually it's pretty cool. Right. Um. So yeah, I'm attacking with spear. Yeah, if we, we need to get rid of this kick, desperately. Oh wait. Um, 
Yeah, Omega, you need to roll a D10 first. Why? Back. Because you're adjacent to the antelope, so we need to check if you get ticks or not. Oh, yeah. Oh, but so is Chris. Or did he do that already? No, he, he did not end his turn next to it. The antelope moved to him. Oh, but so because I moved to him. <coughs> yeah, it's oh, on okay. attacking yeah. phases. So yeah, 1d10 please. And don't roll 1 or 2. I'm to roll 1 or 2. And the result of 1 or 2, they are on the ticks and gain. Oh. <clears throat> Ooh. So yeah, he's fine. Yeah, fine, yeah. Oh, fuck off. Don't forget the antelope has one toughness as well. Uh. So it's going to be harder to hit. Why did... Oh, god damn it. Is that one hit, or...? Six yeah. is one hit, yes. But now you have to roll one hide in order to damage it. Yeah, I'm not sure I want to damage it, to be honest. Ew. So, let's see... Six or higher. Six, yeah. Miss a three. So it's just a miss. <laughs> It's actually a really good eye. <laughs> well, guess it depends. Here comes Skarmory with his spear. Yeah, he's gonna make the antelope charge us instead now. Ah, two <coughs> guys. Hmm. Ah, one hit. Yeah, if you get this, we'll get rid of that kick. That's not too bad then, so it's just if you can wound it or not. Yay. Oh, nice. Skarmory just saved the day. Yeah. <laughs> he just got rid of the kick. Oh. Because he, yeah. he used his headband to, get, to put the kick underneath. Oh, nice. <coughs> That's the one where you roll four dice, man. It would have been bad. And you yeah. weren't trampling us, so it's good. Yeah, it's Omega's turn to... Ah, <clears throat> oh, come on, Skarmory, don't cheat. What am I doing? No. Oh. Wrong set one, I was checking wound stack. Uh, you are the monster. Oh yeah, it's four dice, jeez. Furless fret and range? But... One of uh, them. Yeah, one of us. <coughs> so, want me to do a 50 50 or which one can take it? Um, I can take it, I think. Or, well, I'm in a better so position than Skarmory to take, to take it. Okay. Well, it's going to be two damage. Oh, right. oh yeah, because you have to move one space. Yeah. And I don't. I haven't taken any damage <coughs> oh, yet, so. Oh, uh, you've got lots of armor, so. You picked the right one, I think. Six. So. Yeah. So it's two damage to just one of these yeah. locations. So one damage, terminus. Ah, oh, uh, can two take damage. That. He's got two. That's good. Oh shit! I've just realised. Yeah. There we go. These skull helmets we've got. Are pretty oh good. yeah, I had was one for every space, so you were the one space away. That's all lucky. Yeah, oh, yeah, that could have done seven <coughs> damage. Wow. That's why yep. furthest in range. That's why it makes sense now. Um, yeah. So we're back up. Well. Yeah. Would you guys like? Would you like to move I, out of its range? I would range? like to fuck off. <laughs> I move out of the way. Have we been adding its toughness on when you've been damaging yes. it? Yes. Yeah. I've attacked with my axe twice. Haven't had uh, once. Why did you move there, Skarmory? Because if I attack and he's charged, you are fucked. Well, yeah, but you can't attack at all there. No, but I thought it would be better if I just moved. Well, if I move Terminus, you can get behind him after me. Uh, no, uh, I don't want to get behind him. I don't want to stand <clears throat> next to him anyway. He just wants to, like... 
I'm yeah. moving there. Oh, then shit. you attack with I'll a spear. Have to roll again for the fleas Why don't you move there then? Um, I and then you can attack, it. yeah. Yeah, um, just attack him, Skarmory. I don't think he usually charges, it's usually he kicks someone. I think it's only if the only one's in range. Ah. Besides, we have to actually hit him first. Uh, seven? That's a hit. Who a failure. Damn it. I lost my weapon. Yep. Shit, one. Skarmory <coughs> lost his weapon. So are you moving in terms? Well, I'm, it's kicked out of reach. I don't know who's been. So I'm going to attack him. Oh, but you can spend an action to get it back, though. Yeah. Ne yeah. Next round, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to attack him from <coughs> here. Oh, you're attacking? Okay. Bear in mind, if we're attacking from behind Omega, we we'll have to roll for ticks. Uh, as long as you have one or two, should be uh, one. Hit. Doesn't attacking from behind give you plus one accuracy? Yeah, but it's also you gotta roll for a tick. Uh, oh, good. I have plus one strength. I forgot about that. Seven. Oh, it's a, is that a wound? Oh. Yes. Yeah. That was lucky. I keep yeah. forgetting about its toughness. That's um Omega. <clears throat> oh, you actually going for the ticks? Ah, uh, fuck it. Right it's now, just a twenty percent chance. I have plus one strength. So what? When does that come into play? Or how does that work? When you wound. When when you're actually going to wound it. Right, so I have to roll so. five plus, is it? <coughs> yeah, yeah, five to hit and um, five to damage. That including the strength? Yes. Well, well hit. Bushy tail. <laughs> the yeah. magnificent bushy tail. <laughs> I can get an antelope uh, resource if you. Yeah, if you crit it. Yeah. So, and so it knocks it off balance as well, so it makes it. Oh, five or higher? No, six. Oh! Oh, crit! Oh, crit sick! Oh, and you, da you give it an accuracy as well. One screaming antelope resource. And off balance, minus one accuracy token. That means it's going to have less. I mean, hang on, that means it might have to roll. Like, what? Roll have the hellos? I don't know. No, it'll have to roll one higher to hit you. Ah, oh, we have to actually add one, not minus yeah, one. That's take weird. one screaming out the local resource. Is it a random one? Yeah, pull a card. That. Shank bow. <coughs> um, and you've got to move an AI over as well if you haven't already. But yeah, um, it's got um, five you life. Need, you, you need to roll for takes. Two. two. Fuck! Someone's getting ticked. I got ticked off. <clears throat> uh, suffer yep. one brain damage. That's really I bad. I get minus strength token, so I'm back down to zero. I'm back down to normal. No, now you're... Now I'm normal. Yeah. yeah. Oh, did you have one sanity, like... Don't no. minus 
I need to get some more insanity. Yeah. Well. In order to attack. Um, three means in my axe. Fuck it, I'm gonna live dangerous. That's the strength. Three. Yeah. Which gets added to the <coughs> strength of your character and then compared to the monster's so, toughness. I need. F is it five or six? Six. Five. Five. Yes, five. Oh, because I'm behind. Yeah. Oh, two hits. Yeah. Two hits it is. And then you're gonna need to roll a seven or higher. So I'm I think I go oh, for the actually, fairy throw because there's no bad. Yeah, and then it's a five on the giant tongue after that. Yeah, so I need so, yeah. I'll roll for this Seven. first. Yep. Seven for this one. That's a That's... miss. Yep, it is. So this one here, minus two toughness to wound this yep. creation. So five. Ooh. Oh, I could get a minus. Oh, wow. My strength can get nothing after this. Like yes. ones and twos. So it's another wound. Yeah, let's see. I'll just read. I... You suffer one brain damage. Oh, shit. Minus two toughness to wound this location. So, do you want to spend your dry <coughs> encounters or do you want to roll? I'm or do you want. Never mind. I'm gonna use me dry decanthus. Really? Well, I'd, if I roll a one, I'm dead. <laughs> no. You get plus two to any roll, so you can't roll a one. Oh, two anymore. oh yeah, well, I'll roll them. See what happens. It's much more fun that way. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think it's fun. I could die. Well, oh, I, I could do. lose an eye. I rolled one. So yeah, memory, three. No memory loss. Three. It's the best one you could get. Is it? Yeah. yeah oh. It does nothing. Oh, well, that's good then. That's. Yeah. I think I got and that you last time. Saved your dry decanters also. <clears throat> Do I get an sanity or anything for this? No. 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 Right. Um, ticks. I've got to roll for. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you jogging. Minus the strength. Don't have to do anything else. No, just minus, minus one. one strength now. Jeez. Does Omega have a permanent plus one strength for yep. it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Permanent yeah. plus one, yeah. That's. Guess that's everyone's turn, then, isn't it? Yeah. So, a monster controller. Yeah. Bolt. Closest knockdown survivor. It's no one. Furthest threat in range. Either me or Terminus. Yeah. <clears throat> is there a preferred target or should I just random it? Um, I think you should pick me. I was going to say, you've got more armor, haven't you? So he moves one again. Yeah. Um, It's just one dice and then two damage if I hit, isn't it? Yeah. By two damage. Because he moved one space. Yeah, but this is bolt, not ram. So it's a five, so it's a hit. One damage. Oh, it's straight line away from survivors. It's your hand. Oh, so yeah. he moves away now, does he? Yeah, yeah. so he moves full. To be. Six. Oh, it's there, isn't it? One, two, oh, three, four, five, six. Oh, he only moves five? No. One, six. Two, you have three, to move by four, the space five, I've counted wrong. Uh, that's the end of uh, the turn. Yep. Yep. I'll just move my character because I can't do much anyway. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, I'll let the rest of you move first because I think I'm actually going to be able to get in range. Also, it's got one. Mi it's got a minus accuracy as well. The, the boss. Yeah. 
Oh, you can actually hit us, can't you? No, I'm not no. there, I can't. Oh, Garmin, you want to get your weapon back? Three, four, five. You can, you can go here. Yeah. I use my action to get my weapon back. Oh. Was it only using an action, or...? Yeah, it was an action. Can you not go there, Terminus? Yes, I can go there, but I don't want to go there. <clears throat> ah, right. Or even there? Are you not could you, know? at all? you could do then, use your spear. Yes, I'm, I am moving. Yeah, you can get attack range. Oof. It's definitely a hit. So that's God. How much is it? Six plus, or is it seven now? <clears throat> wow, this this is a really good wound. This one. Yep. Too bad I didn't wound him. Oh. What you get? Five. Five. Ah. Uh -huh. oh, that was a really good one as well. Yeah, that would be nice. <laughs> yes, it would have been really nice. It's everyone's turns and in it. Yeah. Showdown time. Basic action. Just gonna graze. Fuck's sake, I wish it would stop moving away. <laughs> we haven't drawn a gobble up card yet, have we? I haven't no. seen any. No, Should because be this room, one, stand. all the S ones are added depending on level. <coughs> oh, let's no. keep moving down them. Don't forget you can use your raw headband if you want to keep looking Omega for things. Uh, I probably should have done it. Because <coughs> I'm thinking we can keep, if you can keep making it do chow down, it's just going to run against this wall all the time. It'll make it easier for us. Do you want me to do that now? <coughs> yeah, you might as well. Yeah, so these are going to have to get shuffled in as well. Draw one of these. So... So you put bite do back then, Chow. But do you want them to keep running away from us? Well, you can get against the wall all the time, so it won't be able to do nothing. Oh, cool. Well, bite then, Chow. So, you can control the monster technically, you can just keep making it run against the wall if you feel like it. Yeah, did you play last turn? Or did you become monster controlling now, Skarmory? I was. Okay, so it's me then. That's that. See you, Omega. If you want to move or not. <coughs> and yeah, to move if you want to. You want me to use my hairband again? <coughs> Well, yeah, yeah. you could. I would say put bite back then, both. Yeah, probably better, actually. Because it's just going to keep moving against the wall, isn't it? No, it's not. It's going to bolt to Omega. Close to knockdown survive first. Oh, Henry. Oh. So yeah, but it's only one. It's only one. Uh, it's only one damage though. Yeah. If you bite, it's gonna attack me instead. Yeah. So you bet off bolt. It bolt. It only moves in a line afterwards, so it's not that bad. None of us are in a line on this. Well, it's gonna basically go back out over here, I think. Or. 
guess you technically can say it goes in the other direction. <coughs> um, actually, it might be better if you put bite on top. Only thing is, I might actually end up with a severe injury from that. Yeah, it's giving you bleeding tokens as well, so. Um, I don't have any, so who cares? <coughs> Alright. So, which one's going down first? If well, it depends. Do you want to take the hit, or is it going to hit me? I don't know. I, mean, I can take a hit too. Uh, Omega's well, never even been problem scratched. Is, if, <laughs> I, I think it's probably better to go for me, because otherwise it's going to run away again. Alright, yeah, do that. Once we get one, rid of one of these AI cards, though, then we can control the monster by just putting Chow down all the time. Yeah. Um, <coughs> yeah, Omega, pull a card. Oh, my controller? Yes. Yep. So... Fault to this, I guess. So... You can move it this way and down, or you can move it round and down. What? No, it's gonna go to Omega. Oh, did you put bolt? Oh, I thought you picked bite. Alright, yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought as well, but. <coughs> that's what I thought as well. <laughs> you must put the wrong one. That's what I was saying. Like, for you, I was like, you can move it down or round depending on which way you want it to attack it. Um, it should be <coughs> one further to the right. So yeah, roll a dice, get an insanity. We are back. Yeah. Um, I'll put an insanity on you, Omega. Thank you. Free. Pretty sure and that's still a hit. Minus uh, accuracy as so well. It's yeah. It's free plus, it gets a free, so... Yeah, uh, it's a hit. It's still a hit, yeah. Two One plus. One damage, so... Roll a hit location. Shouldn't <clears throat> be too bad for you. Unless it's you. Oh, right. Can't do anything now. Fuck. Oh, it's gonna charge now. Yep, and now full move away from all survivors. I think it's there, isn't it? Yeah. I'll wait till you move Omega, then I'll move next. Um, I'm gonna try and bone dart him from here. Can I attack him first, maybe? No? Yeah, well, go for it then. Oh, which one of us does more damage? Um, you probably do more damage. You want me to go first then? Ah, uh, go. Two, two fours. Yeah, so it's miss and miss. <laughs> You're just moving, Chris? Oh, it's moved, yeah. I can't do anything. <clears throat> so. Yeah, and I have one D turn with the bone darts. Back. Oh, no. Back and back. Oh. I miss. It's your turn, Scrammery. Yeah. Yeah, you're the only one left. <laughs> Who I'm monster control now? You are. Oh, Megan needs rolling the the fl fl fleas. All oh, right, yeah. <clears throat> ah, he's fine. Nothing. Yeah. Right. Now, Chris, is monster controller. There's only two cards left. Oh, yeah. Uh, three, sorry. Three. So, bite. 
Those are Survivor in Field of View, which is you. me. Um, yeah. So all. Yeah, I'll put the insanity on you. Thank you. Um, one, one speed, two damage, and then a bleed. Well, you don't have any bleeds. As long as it doesn't hit your arms, so you're fine. So it's just one dice, isn't it? Yeah. And he's got to roll high because of his accuracy. Oh, it's a hit. Nine. Then how many it's damage eight. to the location? Two. Oh, two. Chest, can I take that though? Yes, you can. Oh, yeah, that's. And one bleed token. Um, guess that's it then. Yep. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna let you in a mega move first. Well, I'm just gonna attack it again. Oh, well, let me move. Yeah. <laughs> oh, right, you're moving for it. Right. I thought you were just going to attack it from there. I was going to say, well, let me out Oh, no, I'm moving behind it. Yeah, it. <coughs> yeah, go for it then. Or do you want to do it first? Just no, no, it. no. Just. No, well, I have more hits just in case I take charge or something. I can take it. Nah, it's alright. I'll be fine. I don't think it doesn't usually charge. I think, I think <coughs> it's more likely that it's going to do like a all around it, him or attack behind him. Yeah, I think it's more or less the line that charges, doesn't it? Because it does grabs. Yeah. Because this is more or less... One hit. Oh, perfect hit. This is only if it doesn't have any targets, it just shoots off in a direction. I'm happy with that. <laughs> Hope I get another critical. <clears throat> yeah. That's it, say at the bottom. I mean, I, oh, Blood runs turns down the screen. Me, Chris, so you don't actually have to uh, move. That's what I was about to say. I'm happy with that. Uh, Six or higher. Lope runs yeah. down the screen and Lope side. The blood loose. Do I not the have the accuracy for being. <coughs> oh, no, because he's already turned to face me, so I'll lose my accuracy. No. No, no this you is your strength. Need accuracy now. You need strength now. This is oh, your strength I've lost roll. Me strength. Fuck, okay. Yeah. This is where strength comes into place. Yes! Yes! So then it just turns. Yeah. I buy AI card, so there's only three left. Yeah, and you need to roll for ticks. <coughs> You're fine. Oh, I'll attack them. Oh. Two. That's actually not bad because then you can move out of the way. No, you, uh, you, uh, yeah, you can move and you still can get them. We could call it this round if you all had. The only thing I'm worried about is uh, trap cards. Don't seem to have any. Uh, Should be one here. Yeah, so I need. How much to wound? Because it's, it's got tough. Has it not got minus toughness and things? Or? No, it's got plus toughness. You need seven or higher. Oh, nearly a land. Someone's getting trampled here, by the way, if you had it. <clears throat> yeah, but he didn't. I didn't, oh, so it doesn't do anything. And I'm gonna move there. So it's actually a good thing you didn't hit it there because someone was getting trampled. Well, someone being you. <coughs> Our Hammett says jump backwards, he's behind him. Yes, but it says to face the attacker and then jump backwards. Oh, okay. So that's one miss. Right, go front. You two get behind him oh. kill him. Come on. Uh, one hit. And it's not a trap card. Has a failure though. <clears throat> yeah, but he's not adjacent to the attacker, so he's fine. It's hit. You did hit it? Yeah. Yeah, he did. It's got right. two hits left. Right, Scar, for you. Uh, oh, he already did. It's it, yeah. my, me left. Oh, <coughs> with the spear. Could you? You could potentially kill this. 
two hits. Well, if you get two uh, hits, I'm gonna uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna hit the trap card anyway. You six. know it's true. Mm, six left. Uh, one and six. One hit. Ah, you're good. Ah. Oh. you think that? We need a club or a shield. Oh, no, this I was. I think you must make them with the antelope. I'm guessing. Nine. And it's a hit. So he's only got one left. He's only got basic yep. attacks now. Skarmory. And Skarmory's the monster controller. Basic attacks, that's calm. That's me. No knockdown uh, surviving range. It's no one. Yeah, so graze. Wait, so he just <coughs> grazes from now until uh, he dies? Yep, pretty much. Oh, Omega gets damaged. Oh. Yep. <coughs> Where's it go? Oh, it goes forward, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> you got trampled. <laughs> uh, I got trampled, eh? Um, they suffer yeah, so you get damage. one damage. <coughs> Roll a hit location dice. Yeah, so technically, even now, it's just going to run into the wall until it dies. Pretty much. That and potential reactions and trap cards and shit. Oh, and the hit locations, yeah. Yeah. Um, one, two... Actually, I'll let you move first, Garmin, then I'll move down the board with you. <coughs> can one just turn me over so I can kill it? No, because no one has any survival. Oh, damn it. Wait, I could actually sacrifice one of my strength <coughs> tokens to get the survival. You can you could. survive oh, what? Oh shit, I could do that too. What can you do, oh, no. I can sacrifice one of my strength tokens to get the survival. And then use it to get me up so I can go behind him and kill it, hopefully. That, that sounds like a plan. I'll do it, you're up. Oh, I see, sick. <clears throat> right, probably kill this fucker. I will hate you if you fail now. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie, probably gonna happen. It's yeah. got quite a lot of toughness now though as well, hasn't it? So one, one head. And still a trap somewhere in there. Suck a dick on my Fuck's <laughs> sake! <laughs> That's my fault! Wheel and slide. Yes. You asked for it. The the scream that low panics, it's under mouth, unleashing an unhuman will. It buckets wildly and leaps into the air. <laughs> Honestly, it feels good Tackers. that Omega got it. Yeah, well, he's got the most stuff anyway. The attacker is doomed, all survives adjacent to the monsters, suffer two brain damage, per monster. Level. That's none of it. Oh, is well, that Omega? That's Omega. Yeah. yeah. So I get two brain damage. Well, you, you lose your insanity and then a severe. Brain so, trauma. Uh, so that's a roll. Oh no, sure, I have to. I don't I have to roll. I have to use me thing. Well, why do you want to use your thing? I have to. Do you? Yeah, he's got. Yeah, uh, consumable. I have to use it. Oh, you can take the chance on the roll because. No, no, I can't. You've got I have darkness. To use it. Yeah, that's the consumer if the choice arrives. Yeah, because it's the binge eater. <laughs> So he gets, so he gets yeah, survival. Knock back five and knock down. But you get your survival back. Do you? But say, did not say when you consume you get some survival somewhere. No, it's when you depart. I saw I lose two survival for departing, but I don't need it anyway. Uh, <coughs> let's see if, yeah, you need to full move forward as well on the antelope skarmory. It's going that way anyway. <clears throat> so that yeah. binge eating kind of uh, saved your life. <laughs> well, anyway. just all rolled and got nothing. Uh, odds were he wasn't gonna die from that roll anyway. So 
but I need another yeah. one loose. Next uh, I'm not in, I'm not in range. So yeah, antelope. Isn't that gonna be closest yeah, knockdown survivor? So, uh, oh. But he's not in range. No, he's not in range, no. But does people <coughs> stare at him? Why? Oh no, sorry, range. As I yeah, say, I keep needs... mixing them uh, up. So basically, we just gotta move down and attack it now. Hopefully. Yeah. One hit. You can technically attack us, Skarmory, if you went here. Oh, wait, there as well. Or there. Come on for the win. Is that a hit or? Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> One hit. That's not. <laughs> Why did you draw a hit location if it didn't hit? He got one hit. He got yeah. He got one hit and one oh, miss. Oh okay. And nine. Oh, what's the failure? Minus two. So uh, seven. I need to get. Oh wow. Because I held Omega. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. So uh, if I miss, it's Omega's fault. Everyone agreed to that? You yeah. mean if you roll a six? Yeah. Die! So what have you got to roll? Good plan. Ah, uh, it's a five then. anyway. It was a good plan, and just draw the trap cards. Fuck you. <laughs> then it wasn't a good plan. Well, good if attack him with it. a melee weapon, well, it is kicked out of reach by screaming antelopes thrashing. Oh, I dropped my weapon again. Yeah. Yeah, so it's kicked it out your hands again. God damn it, Skarmory, <coughs> stop dropping your spaghetti. Right, I'll, uh... Can't help oh. it. <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm just gonna move into range and kill it. It's a fucking screaming oh. antelope. Come on, then. Yeah, you know I'm gonna miss both, right? Yeah. It seems the longer the fight's gone, the harder it gets to kill. Oh we one hit. The fairy tail. Oh the tail. Call him in the tail. It's a magnificent fairy tail. <laughs> yes. He's dead. GG. I think it's four of each. It can't even stand on its head. <laughs> uh, yeah. One hunt XP and one weapon proficiency if eligible. Yeah, so do, I I, do I not get it even though I don't have a proficiency? No. No. Just get um, one hunt XP. You, you can't get any weapon proficiency because you don't have enough hunt experience to unlock it. No one does. Uh, so. Okay. Uh, four basic resources and four screaming antelope resources. I'm gonna see what these screaming antelope things are now. We're gonna unlock something as well. No. There's another bone thing. Hmm? We got two hides and two bones. Uh, a skull. Well, cause. Oh, log juice. <clears throat> because I've already got a hide, I wouldn't mind taking a bone. Ah, uh, well, I have I took plenty of hide, so I'll take that spiral horn then, because I already have a shank bone. Where are all of these hides that you have? Well, in my armor. That's what I used to make all the armor. Uh -huh. So I'll take the Unless bone. one you want the bone, I don't mind. I well, just... we're, we're all going to share. I don't know, so really yeah, matter. it doesn't really matter. Well, look, whoever needs headgear should take the skull. <clears throat> well, I think everyone has headgear. Scar. Uh -huh. I was going to say. We need to get Skarmy some armor. He's literally got a helmet uh, he, and a belt. He needs hides. He needs yeah. hides. Like all the hides. <laughs> um. I'll make you some armor. I've got two hides on the Skarmory. I'll okay, help kick you out a bit. When the monster is defeated and a survivor with 20 plus insanity 
die. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, none of us are insane. Yeah. The settlement has heart flute. We don't. Yeah, we don't. So yeah, that's it. Yeah. So let's back the settlement then. And we heal and reset, yeah. don't we? Yeah. Yeah, heal and reset button there, Omega. Alright, cool. <coughs> Oops, sorry, I was about to get my character. Do we not unlock something now we've killed the antelope? Like the antelope place? Nope. Hasn't... No. Because <coughs> there is an antelope. It, I guess. Yeah. I think it's worth we building. Need things. Yeah, like we, we killed the cat them. and got a catarium. Do we not get so hunt for killing that thing? No. You nope. don't get it automatically. You have to use an endeavor, don't you? Yeah, to build the stone circle. Seriously, think we should build the weapon crafter, dude. Well, yeah, we can't build the stone circle anyway because we don't have enough organs. So... I have free bone. If someone wants to throw in a hide, we'll make the weapon crafter. Well, we'll do the timeline thing. I might throw in one. Because I can't really make way any more gear to begin with. And I, as long as I've got hide, I can make scar me some armor, which is... Uh, yeah, we, did, we didn't have any dice, <coughs> so we get one each, I think. Yeah, Don't we get a get plus up. one for something as well? Someone of that our old characters. Don't think we get a plus one from anything. Do we not? I thought we got something for. Uh, I had other character that died. Oh after. right, yeah. Yeah, you get ones if people die. <coughs> right. Okay. So. But I also had a character that gained on an endeavor. Where oh shit, we do! We all have one understanding! Yes. Every new, every new survivor gains one understanding, so we'll always have one at least. Yep. So, that's the settlement event then, isn't it? <clears throat> yeah, yeah, it is. Oh, it's not the plague again. Acid storm. The air oh. takes us... Taste sour and burns the survivor's cracked lips. The sky cracks in great flashes, revealing spiraling black clouds. Finally, it opens, dousing everything in acid rain. Roll D10. <coughs> okay. Yeah, let's go, Skarmory. Please roll a good one. Oh, Chris is rolling. Okay. Please, not the one. Oh, there's not all the size. Uh, oh, lantern. Oh, town, oh. so. Uh, some debris of the settlement becomes useful due to the strange effect of the storm. Add one scrap to the settlement storage. Nice. nice. Do we not do uh, any of the lingering effect? Do I just take uh, one of the scraps from the basic resource then? Yep. Because yep. we'll have paint. Doesn't this do a lingering effect? Well, do we have any... Art endeavors. Yeah, we've got paint. But that's not an endeavor. Is it not? Oh. No. Oh. That's an, an innovation. innovation. <clears throat> oh, right. Wait, what? Do what? we use an innovation to do this then, or what? No. Oh, requires cooking, requires nightmare training. Yep, which we have neither. So that wasn't too bad then, we gained. That was pretty good. Yeah, that count can be skipped. Timeline. So, we're like on a story now, don't we? Armored yeah. strangers. Wait, what's Hands of Hate? I don't remember just doing that. We <coughs> did. It's the one yeah, where you've got red hands. Fire glove. Oh, nice, okay. So this is, this is Armored Strangers' story. You are visited by enigmatic figures, fully enclosed in armor. They march silently through the settlement, only noise is a metallic clang. 
as they pass before the, each survivor and tap their lantern hal halberds against the ground. The survivors have an, no choice but to helplessly aw await their mute deliberations. Add King's Man to the Nemesis encounter list. The strangers count people and take action based on the population's total. Wait, what? Yeah, we have uh, eight or more people. So we go on the destructive action side. Wait, what's the resist? Uh... Yeah, that's something we don't really want to do. Yeah, that's basically okay. we don't take shit and then we go and fight the Kingsman. Yeah. Which is, uh, he's... <laughs> he's, yeah, he's like the butcher on steroids. He's really hard. But we are gonna have to fight him at some point. But that's yeah. But he's Add him to the We'll list. get some gear. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So now we need to roll on a d10. Yeah, Chris, you can roll since you rolled the d10 last time. The, oh, the pressure. <laughs> Ten. Uh, a, hal a halberd is left in the settlement with the with the survivor in play paled on it as a reminder. Suffer minus one population at the guidepost innovation to the settlement. Well, I'll we get got the innovation. That should that should still be a good roll though, even though we lost it. That that is a good roll. <clears throat> because we got the innovation. Oh. I was hoping I was going to get a halberd. Oh, plus one survival when we depart. It's five attempts to pull the weapon free from the ground. Roll 1d10 and add their strength. If the result is 12 plus, gain the lantern halberd. Ray gain loses innovation. Does anyone want to try and roll for that? <laughs> we don't have anyone with enough strength to even be able to do it. <laughs> Shouldn't the Lantern Oven be at the uh, one next to science? No, because we should get Ammonia here. Okay. Which we still don't have. So later down the line, we actually have a chance to get that halber, the, the legendary yes. weapon. Yeah. Jesus. Now we can develop it. Yay! Right. <clears throat> Is there literally any born a skull helm? Oh, you've already got a skull, so that didn't. Remember. I'm just trying to think of gear for you, Skarmory. I have a helmet. I uh, know. I've just remembered. Um, you got the lion one. He needs a body piece and right. I'll a give body her, piece. Get a get a body piece out, and I'm going to give you a hide. Oh, you've already got a health a hide, haven't you? Oh, no, and the helmet to get the plus evasion. So the body oh, he's piece and the he's already got a helmet, it. though. Yeah, but that's <clears> stacks, <throat> isn't it? Isn't that a stackable one? No, it's just a helmet. Ah, shit, no. Yeah, you don't get the evasion bonus then. But, I can get him, when get him the chest, when get him the chest and some... Shit, the... I forgot to add me plus one evasion to this character. Fuck. I had a plus one evasion that whole time. What about... Could we not get him the... Gloves... And the vest? And connect yeah. them? Yeah. Nah, no, he's already got the evasion anyway. Or the bone dagger. He's got his bone dagger connects anyway, so it doesn't matter. I know, but he could still connect his raw hide vest to his gloves. I would just need to, he's got the dagger. I but still yeah, armor, isn't armor. But he's got stuff connected all already. Oh, I see. He could connect, connect more. Ah, yeah, ah, yeah, good idea. So he could connect another two things if he feels like it. Like he can put something there. So basically, Skarmy, if you move, if he, Skarmy moves that up to like sit, no, sorry, that one up to Dude, there. Skarmy, you could give us all two strength. No, because I need to have a blue one connected <clears throat> somehow. And if you put the chest and oh, the hands anywhere. there and there, yeah, you could connect and get more stats. 
if you know what I mean. There you go, Skarmory. You've got a blue one connected. No, we don't. It hasn't, because there's no blue. It's blue. No. Uh, uh, you can't have a blue. There's no blue anywhere. It just says anywhere. Oh, yes, but it, it needs to be a connection somewhere. Somewhere on his board. He needs a blue with a blue. It is. There, there you go. No, no it no, needs it to be a connect. blue. Do you mean like it doesn't have to connect to this? Connects to anything? Yes, but it has to connect to something else that is blue. That's a weird rule for that to be. That's. Yeah, so. <coughs> anyway, do you want to? I'll, I'll use one of the hides. Uh, one second. How many hides do you need for the. Right. I'll spend two. I can't get a blue connection with that if I use an organ and create a lucky charm. What's that? It's an item that has a blue connection that works with it. With the fecal self? Yeah. 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 yeah Scarm read one second. Yeah, um, do that because plus two strength for us is brilliant. It's brilliant. <clears throat> I'm thinking. He's have plus three then. Yeah, but he's, he uses one <clears throat> survival and his action for that. Ah, oh, if I was just the action. I'm getting you. I'm going to get your chest and some hands. Anyway. Ah, fuck. Well, I'll do. Let's make book. sure. One hide, one hide. So I'm gonna get your chest and some hands, Skarmory. Okay. Uh, hands. And. Oh fuck! Does that mean also I have lost my spear forever now because I didn't pick it up? Um, oh. I don't think so. I think it comes no, back to the settlement. No, it goes back to the settlement, so you can just take it back. Right. Uh, where you're at, Skarmory? Right. So this. Drop them, I do. <clears throat> there will be a way to connect them as well. So no, he's no blue. Down the you bottom. Can, you can put them anywhere you want, really. Ah, there you go. Why don't you move? No, it looks good. Unless, no, unless yeah. uh, you want to do the thing for the blue. There'll be a way around this. Could you not put these three in the corner? Uh, I don't say why are you trying to connect shit? Cut. Well, because it looks cool. <laughs> no, wait, it, it'll get bonuses because if he moves no, these three. No, th there's nothing blue to connect it to. Yeah, he is, he's buying so some. He's buying the lucky charm, isn't he? Oh, okay, are you? Oh, so, no, hang on, he needs an organ. We don't have an organ. Oh, we do, um, we do. So, why. So I'm saying, so why doesn't he put the helmet, the bone dagger, and the spear there? There. No, because you want the bonus from these. Well, I don't get, because I need a blue connection yeah, to it. Yeah, you get the bonus from that. You get that, though. When the part of game on oh. survival. No, get yeah, and uh, that one doesn't matter if a connection. Oh. does go... Oh. Yeah, he doesn't have a blue helmet, that's what I'm saying. He's already got a helmet. So. Oh, it doesn't matter, then, yeah. yeah. And Omega, you wanted a bone for no, a hide, and we can build the weapon. But if, if that's what we want to do, have you got three bone? Like, I have three here. Does anyone have a spare hide? We have uh, like, <clears throat> yeah, to hide from the antelope. Right. So, do you want to spend that and get the weapon crafter? So do we want to build the weapon, or do we want to build the Leller or Stone Circle. Oh no, free organs, we can't afford it. Yeah, exactly. We can't build oh, the Stone Circle, uh, sadly. We can't, we can't build Leller because you need an organ for that as well. Why oh, can't you? Uh, we don't have enough hides for that. Build, build the weapon one, though. We can build the weapon yeah. if we want. I'm down for that. I'm down for that as well. Now they're discarded, aren't they? Yeah. Alright, I'll spend my I'll, no, I'll, 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 I'll use mine, I'll use mine. Right. <laughs> okay, weapon factory, here we go. Uh, so, Skarmory, do you want the lucky charm or should we innovate with the organ? 
Oh, we can innovate with it. Well, look, each charm would give us strength, though, wouldn't it? Hang on, hang on. What does Lucky Charm do? Search for it. What's it do? Plus one luck. If you have two blue connections. Ah, uh, uh, what's it do by itself? Nothing. Nothing? nothing. nothing. Oh, no, I don't know. It's up to you. <coughs> You'd have to connect two blues to it. So, yeah. basically, there's nothing we have. You'd have to buy two Lucky Charms in order to connect anything yeah, to it, that's... it seems. Yeah. And, I mean, just to be able to use the ability on his helm, I'm not sure if it's worth yeah, it. Yeah, it's not worth it yet. Jeez, you've seen what well, it costs. It then? You've seen what it costs to make some of these. Oh, but they're nice, though. Those aren't too bad. Some of them have got heat required. Oh, skull cap hammer. Rainbow katana. Look at that shit. Yeah, now we're talking for weapons. Oh, we could use some Dever on this one. <clears throat> oh, scraps melting, yeah. Yeah, you need a lot. Two scrap, five bone, five organ. That's a lot of shit. But you could die from the roll. Jeez. Yep. So you don't want to do that without survival. Yeah. Finger of God. You need the Phoenix finger. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Um, innovate. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Let's do that. <clears throat> uh, can we use your bone or your skull skarmory? I'm just gonna buy. I don't know what to buy. Like... Yeah. Uh, do you wanna draw them or? Yeah, you draw four or oh. two. Hmm. I didn't actually unlock. Good cooking, maybe they buy be the best one. I mean, there's even scraps melting, but then that seems more advanced stuff later. On. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think we need scraps melting yet. I think cooking, because you get a survival limit as well. And we might yeah, cooking might not be bad actually. Plus three, and you only got to roll three or a plus, and you'll get cooking unlocked as well. So no, that's a event. Oh, it's a, oh, yeah, sorry, event. Sorry, my bad. I would say cooking, but the ones seem a little but, bit but dodgy. We need, we need to we need to spend a, an endeavor to do that as well. Uh, I can do that. I'll run them. But uh, should we take cooking first and foremost before we do anything? Wait, so, wait, ah, survival limits. What other one do you f think you would like? Or they all got one. Um, I'm thinking limit. sculpture. Otherwise, <coughs> how do we unlock it? Cast strange confront and shadows. We've already unlocked. It, I think I'm uh, on the outskirts of your settlement. Depart size so game plus two survival one night depart. Yeah, we have. Oh, we have. We can do the heat stuff for that. Cool. Uh, see, um, I'm still, I'm still one. I think cooking still, just for the pure fact of the cooking event. I mean, because what the gear we have, we're all going out with more survival than we can spend anyway. 
Most most times, anyway. Yeah. Well, go with cooking them. Oh my god, you wanna vote? What for? Which, What's the pick? which one you want up the top of here? Yeah, with these four. Oh, the four? Okay. <clears throat> you only pick one though, like, if we're trying to work out which one. Oh, survival, I might have liked that. Oh, there's two of them. Hang on. Face painting is actually good for slow development. What the hell's wrong with her head shape? <laughs> it's like she lost half a brain. What sculpture consequences? Basically, extra things for the innovation deck. So it means like crap of stuff in here, so it's harder to get the better stuff out. So we'd have to make pull out like crap of stuff if you know. And what I mean. what's cooking for? It's an event, like a book event thing. We would have to look into. I kind of need to know. So I'm trying just. Is what's better, cooking or sculpture consequences, basically? I vote cooking, but I don't know. What do you vote, guy? What do you vote, Terminus? Um, I'm just looking through the consequences. <clears throat> because this. Um, cooking. Uh, oh, sculpture gives pottery as a consequence. Which, if we lose all our resources in the settlement, we get to keep two of them. That's good. What's mm. cooking? I um, can't find any consequences for cooking. No, but no, it says it's no a book. Consequence. No, it's it's a because book. it's a lantern of any consequence. You gain yeah. cooking. Or and you don't really have yeah, to I'm... roll very high for it. It's like just a 3 or plus, so... I'm liking the sculpture <coughs> better, and this cooking's really good. Okay, basically... Uh, we can, sp if we get cooking, basically we spend a bunch of resources to cook a thing and everyone gains a benefit, just. It's like permanent evasion, strength. Yes. Permanent? Yeah. But we need to have the materials to be able to do it. I think actually yeah. that's probably yeah. better with yeah. sculpture. I'm going with yeah. sculpture. <clears throat> yeah, because we haven't even met half of that material stuff yet. So yeah, we'll go sculpt. Cooking is good though, like it gives permanent stats, but I think that's more like end game by looks of it. Yeah. So we all get one survival limit added. Sculpture consequences. Yeah, I bumped the survival limit on the settlement sheet. Um I've added your survival skarmory. So I'll have four survival now? Yeah, we'll have oh, four. Survival limit. Limit, limit. Ah, so man. Yeah, I think pottery was the only one. No, I've still got um, <coughs> um, in Endeavor. Um, which, in whose innovation did we use for the... Oh, Endeavor, I mean, did we use for the innovation? 
Oh, uh, I see your mag and you are missing, so... No, I have mine here. Mine just for the weapons factory. Yeah, I'll use mine then. Okay. Right. So, do you want me to spend to try and make babies or whatever in it, whatever you call it? Yeah, I'm not sure if there's that much more we can <coughs> do. Well, we could do uh, the scrap sa scavenge. Though, scrap if you scavenge, roll the bad, yeah. you're dead. Oh, well, you have a, as long as you have a survival. If you have a survival, you won't die. We don't have any. Yeah. Yeah, so let's just leave that for next round, then. Yeah. Until we actually come back with survival. Well, one of my characters actually have one survival now, now see. Yeah, why can't you use that, then? Do it then. But do we honestly it's... need scrap yet? No. I don't. Yeah, that's because the weapons, now the new stuff, need scrap. For some of it. We, do, we already have like scrap too. Three things. Some, some of the stuff still needs cat bones and things. Uh, uh, it's not really worth it. Better we be no. locked the population. So we're gonna do which one? I want to do then the population one. It's oh, augury. Roll. All right, I'll spend mine then. I'll go and roll. Yeah. It's a three. Did we get any pluses on this? No, I don't think so. Okay, <coughs> then we lose a resource. Fuck, we asked, we asked, but I took the bone away then. You Either that or understanding. No, I, I would say we removed the scrap we got. Okay. Gain one understanding. Ooh. Yeah, I'll Close do an insight. Nice. Yes. Intimacy. Yeah, so two more dice then. Yeah. Oh, uh, nice. I'm you see, for weapons, is the middle number better to be higher Nine. or lower? So. Um, yeah, you got the twins. <coughs> nice. nice. So how do I unlock this? Love um, making you want the middle number to be lower. So the lower is better? Yeah. We need a hovel, and then we need to get a 10. Yeah. Basically, if we have a hovel and get a 10 roll, we can get a special child. I know, but you can also get an innovative bed. The new side gains plus one strength as well. Yeah, That's pretty yeah. good. But then we need to get those seven or <coughs> eight. Oh, you can only get them on seven at right, okay. Yeah. Same as the child can only be rolled on a ten. Yeah. Yep. I wonder how you even unlock them. There must be something we get later on. It's innovations. Oh, they're innovation, right. Yeah, the hovel is like one of the basic ones that are in the deck at the start. Right. And I think the bed they say follow up or a consequence of getting a hovel. We still haven't unlocked this one either. Yeah, though. hovel is in the basement. I wonder um, what this is. Just, uh, yeah, that's like faith or whatever it is. Skarmory. It's a timeline event that unlocks it. Alright. Mm -hmm. um, can you convert your thing and give it to me? Because... I can't go out unless I have a consumable and we lose our plus uh, one strength for everyone. Is it if worth consuming that though? No, I'm not going to consume it, I just need it. Wait, what? what? You have your bug. You no, no, I can't. It has to be in the deck. It says Doesn't... one in the grid. It does read it. It says one in the grid. Uh, in the gear grid, yeah. Yeah, so. But that's a waste just it... to. No, it's just, it's just giving it over to me. It's not a waste. Well, in that case, you need to build it. Otherwise, Chris can give his to you. 
Well, but if he doesn't, that means I will have to switch characters. He, we'll have to switch him when we lose our plus one to everyone, and I, I become shit again. <laughs> so it's up to Scarmory, <coughs> I suppose. Well, Scarmory or Chris. Wait, how? Oh, Chris R has one. He can give me his. Uh, I'll, well. give, I'll give you me. mine. No you, way. You don't, you don't have to. Because I've no, got more that, armor. That's not the same one. Yeah, it is. Oh, it is. It's for the grid. Yeah. Right. Can I? Can I take the bones and make some bone darts and? For well, self a range weapon. Not no, better saving it, them to make good, better stuff if, next if, round. If you want, you can have my bone darts. Hang on, how many bones do we have? One, I think. <coughs> if you leave it one round, get one bone, you can build a fucking skull hammer. Just because I've got or like. Or a scrap know, sword. You haven't got no range really now. Good. No, but I have a spear. Which lets me attack from two spaces away at least. Out. Bone. <coughs> and to be honest, right. the bone darts are kind of shit. Yeah, they must like crazy. Uh, it's just in case I need to use a range if I'm out. Yeah. Maybe Omega should get my bow and arrow. You want me to why? So that you have some range attack. Why do you have two ranges? Well, I have my spear, so I can have one space away. Yeah. So, you, like, if there's any like. Well, I kind of use my off things, use the, the helmet, so yeah. it'll be either the helmet or attacking it with the oh, bow. Oh, I see. Yeah, it might actually be worth you keeping the bow, Skarmory. No, okay. <clears throat> what about giving it to Chris then, because he wants a range. Uh, no, I no, no. My bone darts. Please give us bone darts. It's just, it's literally just in case, like, I can't get in range. Like, at least they're not in this zone or whatever you call it sometimes. Yeah. Um, Basically, when the lion does ground play, you yeah. don't want to be useless. Then oh, again, yeah, you're still going to miss it. it so. this bug then? What? Oh, we all don't have. No one has survival. Well, they don't want me bug because I don't need it. Nah. Can we not just um, put in the Reese Eye in the settlement? There's no for vermin. Yeah. Or consumable. Just put in. I, guess I think Omega, sh Omega can walk around with his bug. Yeah, just keep it on me. <laughs> um, <clears throat> question is, what do we hunt next? Just I'd say another antelope, because that was pretty easy. Well, uh, alright. Because, bear in mind, the next one, the phoenix unlocks. So... We've got... The way I look at it is we've got this round to hunt something next, and the round after, then we're fighting the Kingsman. Yeah. So we, are, it, uh, we have five innovations, right? So how do we unlock uh, them? We probably do, actually. How do we yeah, unlock Yeah, we have five innovations. <laughs> well, we have six, even. So What's how? That that, is that activated yeah. event? Yeah. yeah. This is a fun one. Um, I was going to ask, how do we unlock the antelope building then? We build it, we need three organs. Oh. <clears throat> Hooded knight. That's what we're okay, on there. No one has a twilight sword. Uh, nope. Um, roll below the mysterious yeah, so agenda. needs to roll d10. Uh, thank you for the follow. <laughs> I roll. To what we're rolling on here? Seven. The hooded knight forces a tattered parcel into the hands of the returning survivor with the most hunt XP. If tied, randomized. The hooded knight leaves with unfinished business. Uh, who has most? Uh, no so one. Everyone, everyone has one. Uh, it's random. Me. Well, <coughs> roll D10. Wait, so. Uh, no. No, he's. 
I get a tattered par parcel. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you get Twilight Sword Rare Gear. Wait, what? The yeah. survivor gains the Twilight Sword Rare Gear. Place it wow. in their grid now. The survivor may select Twilight Sword as a weapon proficiency type. It um, gives you a fucking sword. This block. weapon is cursed. The weapon's cursed, though. This may not be removed from your gear grid for any reason. When you die, archive this card. Oh, what to do? So you've got to archive the card if you die, though. I think. Aye. You can't wow, switch it. Wow, that's... <clears throat> Yeah, but it's cursed, good, actually. <laughs> Holy shit. One uh, yeah. Have, have fun trying to hit with that Skarmory. It Wait. doesn't have a hit number, what the fuck? Accuracy is 9 Twilight Sword. Oh. So basically, he, he hits on a 9 or 10. But the way, and it decreases with the higher my proficiency level is, or? Yeah. Yeah, it's so easier to hit with the higher your proficiency gets. If you want to put it as your proficiency. But yeah, that sword, that sword later down the line is a godsend. Nine fucking strength. Yeah, because yeah, later... So if you do hit the screen, <clears throat> damage. Yeah. Um, just saying, Skarmory, in four years you're going to do with the Hooded Knight with it. Oh shit. So you've got a level of... <laughs> Plus, like, I'm sure, um, I'm not sure it's the end boss or later down the line, the Twilight Sword, like, um, it it's a it's weak to the Twilight Sword, so, like, you do yeah, massive, you do massive damage. But, again, like, when... <laughs> but that means I still don't I have to avoid dying, also. But you're going to have to fight the Hooded. Yep. Unless I die before. So add Hooded Knight to the timeline in four years from now. So yeah, we. I added the unfinished business in four years. Jesus. I should say Hooded Knight, I'll change that. Yeah. But that means that basically we could get the sword again then if I die <coughs> or. If you die before, then yes. Okay. Right, can we. How do we get weapon proficiencies? Um, it's... First, you get two hunt experience, and then you get to pick your weapon proficiency. Right. After that, you get you get one each showdown where you actually cause damage with your weapon. So we big we've basically got to go on another hunt, kill it, and then get the weapon. That's right. how you'll unlock your weapon proficiency. So, ah, uh, nah, it should be just antelope. Just, just wreck the antelope a couple times. What does cumbersome and sentient mean? Oh, it's... Sentient means you need to be insane to use it. Okay. Cumbersome, I think it means you use up your move as well to use it. Okay. And slow them. I'm gonna check. Oh, it gains um, two. Yeah, cumbersome is you need to spend both movement and action to activate it. Okay. And slow is slow weapons always have an attack speed of one. Ah, okay. So but even if you get plus speed, it you can't get more dice rolls on it. Yeah. But man, it gains devastating two against the watcher. Yeah. Yeah, and that's the end boss. Oh, he's a fine boss. Yeah. yeah and so he's, please he's get Twilight Sword very, <laughs> oh, he's very hard. He land in year 25, we fight him. Yeah, he's uh, very strong. We can start fighting him in land in year 20. Okay. But Would what you... are the rest of land in years then? Level in if you want, to, like gear. <laughs> yeah. Isn't he the <clears> end boss? He's really hot. Well, he's the last nemesis, but I mean, you could continue with quarries and shit after ah, that if I you see. want to. Bear in mind, depending on his, depend on the year we we'll fight him. Okay. Is how how much toughness he has. So, so if you want we to fight, fight him, him as fast as possible, honestly. Yeah. If you fight him on on the twenty fifth year, he's got twenty five toughness. Fuck me. 
I don't know. But if we then you start get, shit. yeah. But then you start get using all your settlers in one go, don't you? To increase stuff well, like you. Yeah, well, stuff. I mean the problem is I suspect we're gonna get wrecked here. Yeah. On the Kingsman. Yeah. I kind of want to fight the Phoenix, but like. Um, does <coughs> the Phoenix usually send people back to land in year zero? The the tend to like rewinds time and stuff and fast forwards yeah. time and stuff and wait do we have to fight the phoenix next no, no we don't. it no. unlocks it what Maybe. but if i think regal visit number 11 we have to fight it there basically i think i think the feather <clears throat> what you do is if you don't fight it you go straight to, i think regal means it like is tax you it's not a good thing i think is that right No. So it's it adds the hand to the nemesis encounter. Yeah. All oh, right. So there's we don't really ever have to fight it, then, do we? No, I don't think we have to. But then you get you won't ever get its armor set play like. Uh, you need it for yeah. like the katana. <clears throat> the katana is OP as fuck. And um, you also the antelope gear is really good as well. Like it has really good stats on it, like bonuses. There, that's the. Uh, the guy that the rips hand. children out of people's bellies. <laughs> he's uh, he's very hard. Yeah, like the watch is insane. Like. <clears throat> You're saying how we'll lose. Yeah, well, I have to go, so. Right. Um, so, what we're hunting next time? Oh, he's an antelope, probably. Okay. I mean, we can try a level 2 li lion, maybe, I don't know. Well, we think we could take a level 2 lion? Probably not. <clears throat> um, I don't think I have enough armor. Yeah, I think antelope. Trying to unlock the antelope building because the antelope sets a whole new armor set. So you've got you've got the raw hide set. The again antelope set. Like there's a whole like tier gear of antelope stuff. And I want to get axe proficiency. Um, is that it then for now? Or yeah. just I guess. It, we're going to the depart section, so fight the antelope's pretty easy to kill, hopefully. And farm for some gear. Um yeah, I'll see you later. Right, see you see later. later. Yeah, I've saved everything. Okay, so I think we're gonna we'll go antelope else. next. Um if you watch this video on YouTube, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment again. Um, let us know if you're enjoying the series or not, or if you ah, think we should do funny. anything else. <laughs> um, if you're watching this on Twitch, don't forget to follow. And thanks for all the support, guys.